Hey, hello everyone, what is cooking all you good looking people out there and welcome to another exciting episode of Starbound. Here we are today going on a major quest. Oh my goodness, I'm quite excited for, uh, for that for sure. This is going to be uh, a good time. We're just looking around to try and find a desert planet, uh, but uh, we uh, aren't finding one quite yet. That is a desert planet right here. Um, let's go. Let's go to the other desert planet. Let's go to uh, to this one right here. We're gonna be uh, heading off to a desert planet today, and uh, doing some good stuff. So now we can go make some uh, some glass blocks here. Uh, how many can I make? I can make 96. What if I just made uh, I don't know a simple number like 50 glass blocks? Great. And what if I went here? Uh, no. What if I went to my own personal crafting menu? and made uh, a ton more bandages what do we got 35 uh, let's just make uh, let's just make 20 more bandages for now wooden planks are always useful let's go and make uh, I don't know a hundred wooden planks and then wooden platforms we can go make uh no I'm gonna say a hundred and fifty wooden platforms should be good. And torches. Well, we actually can make quite a bit of torches. 102 torch. Uh, we don't need to make any torches right now. Okay. So, we are all equipped. All good to go. Let's, uh, let's beam down to our planet and go look for some oil. Now, is oil going to be found on the surface of the planet or not? That is something that I don't yet know. As we found out, this is actually, uh, this is actually the planet that has, um, this is the planet that has, uh, the, uh, the, the healing water. So that's actually pretty sweet. There you go. Alright, that thing died. That's good. Well, we couldn't kill that, but that's fine. So, maybe we're gonna be good here. We can shoot that. Oh my god. Oh, jeez. Louise. Three. Yeah, three. All right, so that thing is the thing is up there. Okay, a lot of healing water, no oil to be found. So I don't know if oil is going to be. I mean, oil deposits are underground, right? Wow, this thing! I swear to God. Okay, I mean, maybe I can go. All right, fine. I shouldn't have attacked that thing. There you go. That thing dived in me and I got it. That's nice. Yeah, if I if I have to think, I'm going to say oil deposits are likely uh, to be found underground. Yeah, whatever, but we'll, 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 we'll walk around the surface just in case there are surface level oil deposits. I feel like, I don't know, for some reason, like big old basins of oil just bubbling at the surface... Feels like something that there could be on a planet like this. Okay. Oh, that thing's not dead. It's hard to believe. Oh. Hello. Oh, sorry. Um. There you go. Alright, you're satisfied. You guys don't have any, uh, you guys don't have any secret oil for me here, do you? We don't really, I mean, yeah, what can we, what can we do here? We can go look there. What is this? That's 120. Rate of fire, energy per shot, 39. What is that? Energy per shot, eh, it's same. Same sort of deal, really. Um, a head, some headgear. Well, we can go, we can go do that. Thankfully, they don't care if we raid their chest or, or really raid their, uh, raid their anything. Alright, yeah, we'll stay out of trouble, don't worry. We're not trying to kill anyone quite yet. We're just, uh, we're just, we're just moving out. We're not strong enough to come and sort of wipe all of these people from the face of the earth. Oh, hello. How's it going up there? Uh, we can move this way. We can go all the way up to the top. Maybe there's some good stuff up there. I certainly hope that there is, although I, sometimes these big giant structures in Starbound, there's just nothing there. And it looks like this might be, oh, wow. Yeah, hey, we'll stay out of trouble. You'll eat us. Wow, okay. Way to make some big threats there to us. My god, look at this. Look at this insanity up here. Okay. Yeah, you'll eat us. That's fine. Still nothing. 
Okay, this is a really tall building. It's unbelievably tall, actually. Uh, there doesn't appear to be anything here at all, really. We can go look in these boxes, but really, they're empty. Man, that was crazy. All of that just for just for pretty much nothing. All right, there you go. Let's go all the way down again. There we are. I mean, that was a long journey for nothing, but you know what can I say? I was uh, I was curious. No, very well. Let's go down here again. We're looking for oil, but maybe maybe we won't find it on the surface. That's what I'm starting to think. But well, I'll go through just in case we can find it on the surface. Just some random books. We don't really care about that. I'm not gonna go up these buildings anymore. We're just in like a big floor and hideout. All right, very nice. And we can continue seeing uh, just some evil monsters. Oh my god, oh, some of these attacks do a lot. Some of them just do nothing. Great, like this. What is this? A big the throwing axe and some healing. That's nice. Very good. Ooh, the light the light does the lighting is nice in this game though, I will say that much. So oh that only does 16, but it does a lot if I hit them point blank. That's my problem with this weapon. Is I'm trying to zap them to death. When really what I should be thinking of is I should be trying to not zap them to death. Uh, but um, to actually hit them with it, because then that's when it really does damage. Oh my god. Well that thing did a lot. But it's only, it, I mean, that was 16, so really, it's not that much when you think about it. There you go. Nine. Let's heal up. Let's heal up. All right, we got, we got healed. Uh, we're coming, I mean, we've, we've done a big journey here, but seriously, not much. My god, I guess there's no, there is no surface level oil here. And I don't want to go too far. I think I'm going to go back to the beginning uh, before I start this off. All right. And there you go. Mostly because what we want to do is we want to uh, we want to just be able to um, collect. Uh, we want to be able to go like down in a big hole. And f oh, my God. Whoa, what the hell? Okay. Well, you've got some issues here. I guess I could go up. Or I could try and fight these guys. I could see what's in there. I mean, there's going to be others along with that uh, along with that one that are going to be there. So maybe... All right, there you go. There we are. Trapped like the olden days. Okay. What what do they have in here that is so important to these to these to these guys that um, that I can't see it? That's my question right now, and it's sort of why I am going to continue moving on because there could be some great riches in here uh, that I'm going to want to have. Great. All right. So you are going there. Uh, then we must make. Well, we can't really make a leap of faith, but we can just make sort of an ele a, a walking line going up. And we'll try and climb this uh, crazy tower. There you go. Like this. All right. What do we want to do? There you go. Very nice. All right. Those guys are out. Oh, crap. This is going to be a bit tricky. Okay. So we need to freeze these guys in place. Okay, you are going to be trapped. Very nice. Is there anything I can do with that thing? I mean, it looks pretty cool. But other than looking cool, does it actually do anything? Well, we've 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 capped Oh, I'm dead. Oops. Well, there you go. That's the end of my story. All right, let's uh, let's beam let's beam down to the planet and just go mining for oil instead because I think that's probably uh, the wa most wise scenario if I had to just make a, a guess as to what is 
what's going to help me through this. So we've got big, big mines over here we're going through. We just got to light our way up and eventually we will find a way down. Okay, so big torches. It's time for that. Boom. All right, let's start, uh, let's start going down, digging for oil. Drill, baby, drill. That's going to be our motto for now. Again, we just got to look out in case we find oil deposits uh, because that could be... I mean, look at this. Is that oil right there? Or is that more healing water? I think it's healing water, actually. Go here, light this up. We can go light this up. I think it's healing water. I don't think that's oil. That is... Gonna, well, let's see. What do we get if we... Oh, that's oil. All right. Well, we can... Uh, let's just collect, like, all of the oil. Because that's going to be actually pretty useful for us. The, the more oil we collect, uh, the better we're off. So if we find a big deposit of oil, we want to uh, we want to collect as much of it as possible. Oh, yeah. There you go. I mean, eh, look at this. That is... That is spectacular. Okay. Now we can go just dig right down and collect iron as well. Iron is, of course, something we need quite a bit of. So we can go like that. And also, I mean, this might be a bad idea to put a torch in oil because you don't know what that could do. But, uh, you know, I'm ready. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with the, idea of, uh, with the idea of doing that. Seems like a crazy thing, but uh, sure, why not? Again, we don't really want to collect um, any. Oh, yeah. Wow. This is, I mean, this is a huge deposit. We're picking it all up here. There we are. Oh, man. So good. All right. We can go like this, and we can break through uh, that. There you go. Okay. Get ourselves a torch down, and then just keep collecting. Eventually, we'll split it off, and there'll be a side over down there that we can go to. I don't know if oil hurts us, like if we would swim in oil. No, no, we can, we can swim in oil. All right, so let's just go pick it up from over here then and see all of the oil that we can pick up. Boom. All right. Oh, well, that didn't really help, but we can go like this. There you go. Just drain all of the oil. That's good. Very nice. And what about over here? Anything? What, what is this? Something over here. It's like, a, it's like a tomb. Oh. What's this? Look at this stuff. Oh, wow. Ooh. That looks cool. All right. Uh, let's uh, get ourselves a pick and break into this bad boy. Nice. Oh wow, this looks uh, this looks like it could be rare. Some rare goodies here for us. Okay, it's fine. We're gonna break in. Hopefully, we don't release like an evil curse or something like that by uh, by doing this. I mean, this could be some really nice decorations for our ship. So temple blocks, yeah, very nice. I mean, I doubt these things are particularly rare, but uh, you know, still still worth it. Uh, can we not do anything? Oh, well, we get writing of texts, 11. All right, that's nice. Six, we can place torch down there. And uh, R, we can go over here, pick that up. No, that's just the background. Oh, okay, yeah, we can pick this up. Can we not? We can't pick this one up, apparently. This thing doesn't, it doesn't move. All right, that's fine. Okay. Well, we have desecrated that tomb enough. Now let's go pick up more oil. And, of course, we're going to want to pick up more uh, more iron as well. Uh, desert planets are apparently quite iron rich. So uh, that is a good thing. Oh, wow. There's also there's also something down below here that, uh, that we might be interested in. Now, I don't want to pick up very much copper because copper is crap. I mean, both those two words start with a C copper and crap not that uh, that actually means anything but i'm gonna pretend like it does oh yeah look at this big 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 society down there there was an oil fish 
Uh, you know, it's just like chilling in the oil. Well, you know, uh, it's not going to be chilling in there particularly long. Now, its life is over. It's only going to be, uh, it's only going to be, well, I don't know, wandering about in uh, the middle of nowhere. All right. Let's do this. Break down all of these stuffs right there. I really wish, I mean, I don't think there is a way to heal picks anymore. I mean, that's really sad. All right. There you go. Ooh, diamond. I like that. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's cool. Look at this place. Ooh, big tomb. All right. So we can go like that. And I don't know if these things are going to attack us. I mean, shit. They might. We might get attacked by, like, masks or something. So let's just go like that. And let's just uh, make a hole down like this. And get ourselves... Wow, the those are some cool masks. So... If I go down here, I can see, well, I can see, oh, that's a bed, that's probably gonna, that's probably gonna hurt me, but if I go down here, I can look in this, and we can get, oh, more texts, okay, maybe I'll read them, maybe they'll tell me something, maybe I won't, and we can get, uh, these sort of costumes over here, we can break them, avian sarcophagus, alright, well, you know, there you go, avian sarcophagus is, uh, let's go, let's just dig out of this thing. Let's go straight, straight below it. Very nice. Oh, wow, that is some sort of lumbering giant. It's pretty scary. Oh, okay. We can go here, we can see a bit more oil, so that's nice. Oh, wow, something else over there. Oh, God, all right, no, that's no good. Um, hmm. No, don't like that. Okay, when the hell... There you go. Boom. That's dead. Okay, very nice. So, go over here. And go like this. And I could pick up more oil if I really wanted to. But how much do I have? I have a lot of oil. So I don't really think I need more. Uh, what I need more of is iron. So, let's go nine. Go, let's heal ourselves up. We're also covered in oil. It's just, I guess, fine. It doesn't really matter too much. And let's actually pick it up using this, just because that's going to actually soak up all of the oil as we uh, dig down uh, deeper and deeper into this uh, avian, well, I guess this avian burial site, which somehow they were they managed to actually bury uh, their dead uh, underneath, underneath oil. So that is, I mean, it's rather impressive, actually, when you think about it. Uh, that they were able to do this so long ago. Uh, I don't know any of the lore behind Starbound, so it's not necessarily that this was uh, done particularly long ago. Who knows, maybe uh, the avians uh, currently bury their dead uh, in situations like this. Okay, there you go. Wasn't it Florin on this planet, though? It might have been. Ooh, there is a really cool light, though. Maybe I'll, I think I'll, I'll try and snatch that up. Because I really like uh, I really like the look of this uh, of this really cool sort of um, shiny light they've got on there. So we shall break into this tomb. Okay, and I want to collect yeah crystal torch and more writing. All right, these things don't really contain anything of uh, interest to me. So I can go like this, and I can just break the vases. Doesn't seem to be anything really around, so let's go all the way down this way. Boom. See what we can collect. Maybe I should, I should probably leave. Well, I don't know, maybe I'll take the easy way out. I don't really have a need for my pixels quite yet. Uh, eventually, I will need them, and I will be sad that they go missing. But for the time being, I, I don't really have... Uh, I don't really have a need for them. Well, I guess I can start digging down and see... Well, see, maybe I'll find some iron. That would be really nice. Okay. Like that. I think I'll dig down using uh, using this instead for, for the time being. And, well, then I'll need to die. I don't really know how I'm going to do it, but it seems like there's, there's something else over here. So we can try heading off to that. Oh, water. 
the hell is that? Were we were we under were we unable to breathe for a little bit? I guess we were. Interesting. Okay. Let me go down. Are we gonna find life down here? I really doubt it, but we'll keep trying. I wonder how much copper I have. I mean, how much iron I have. I don't think I have that much iron. I need a lot more. But these temples—they're just so—they're just so distracting. I want to be able to—I uh, want to be able to get to them. So, all right, very nice. Look at this. We're, we're heading towards it, just in case. There's uh, there's some really good stuff, but I kind of doubt that there will be. Honestly, so we can do this. Also, it, it does get very tiring to have to uh, to, to mine using uh, using this this tool here. It's really not good. But the picks they're just so they're just so hard to come by. So that's that's the sad part. The picks they they don't they don't heal. You can't fix a pick anymore. That's really bad. All right, let's go. Let's get let's get a little bit of iron before we keep moving sideways. All right, there you go. Some nice iron. Very good. And apparently we can't breathe for whatever reason. Probably because of some kind of mummy curse. Okay, move horizontal. A little bit down, just in case we find a big vein of, uh, of iron, which we can make steel out of. Because again, our current goal is to make steel so we can make all of the steel tools that we need so that we can... Oh, look at that. It's like, a, it's like an avian guardian. Ooh, that's cool. Maybe if we hadn't desecrated so many tombs, uh, this guy wouldn't kill us, which I've got a feeling he's going to do. But maybe that's a good thing. I mean, it's not really a good thing, but it might not be the worst. So we'll move straight out this way. Try and collect as much stuff as possible from these uh, from these jars and uh, from, from these walls. If we go to our inventory, we can see... Only 60 iron. It's not great, but it's probably enough to make all the machines we need. It's just probably not enough to make everything else that we need, which is a lot more. So we need, we're going to need to collect a ton of iron uh, in the next uh, while. But, you know, whatever. We can, we can make do for now. Again, even this little piece here and the little piece above it uh, are important enough for me to actually go and collect because we need all of this iron. Oh, this guy is getting a little bit agitated. All right, he doesn't, doesn't like my presence very much. Just in case this guy is some kind of raving, uh, raving lunatic, uh, which I think this 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 creature might be. She's gonna go like this, and we'll just there you go. We'll just put you in a nice little sarcophagus. No? Okay, fine. Well, that's still still enough of a sarcophagus for me uh, to feel more comfortable with uh, with that. So, I'm going to go over here. And actually, you know what? I think I'm going to end the episode right here, saying hopefully you guys have enjoyed this one. And as always, tune in tomorrow uh, for us to go raid this chest and then uh, continue digging down to go find more iron. Aw, oh, yeah. Cue the royalty-free music. Three, two... One, go. Come on, everybody, get on your feet. Stand up, look at the screen, and repeat. I'm gonna like, rate, comment, and subscribe. I love watching Aether vids all of the time. Thanks for dropping by and spending the time. Hope you've enjoyed, and let's get on with our lives. Oh, yeah. Thanks to Kevin McLeod for these awesome beats. Oh, yeah. Have a good one.